YouTube, how are you? That's where I'm at, guys. No, if you're new here, like, comment, subscribe. Just subscribe, subscribe. I got 112 survivors. Hey, <laughs> uh, subscribers, so that's exciting. So I'm getting ready for church. <laughs> I had started doing my makeup, but I was like, you know what? Let me just talk and do it so I'll have company to do it so I can stay focused off my husband prolonging, getting ready for church. I'd be in church at exactly 11, 10, 55 or 11, and I already be, and he, he comes in like at the third song of service. <laughs> show y'all what happens. This stuff crazy. You're trying to kill me. I had to bring my favorite up here. So, I'm sorry being in my own bathroom. It feels more girly when I'm getting ready because my husband's bathroom in the basement for you guys that don't know. And then my toilet was not up here for a while and my sink was out. But um, he finally got it together. Let me fix myself. So y'all don't say I ain't got church, baby. <laughs> Anyway, thanks everybody for helping, not not making me feel bad about me acting goofy and just, you know, supporting me. But I came to talk about my son's birthday party. So, for you guys who don't know, my kids are in foster care, but they're coming home. Due to my decisions of drugs and alcohol and stuff like that, I made a bunch of bad choice. Oh, it's too hot up here. Oh, my makeup ain't gonna do right up here. <laughs> I can tell now it's hot. But yeah, they're in foster care, but they are coming home. It's almost ending. They've been gone for about 10 months now, but um, they should start doing the next week visits here. I already talked to the social worker. If you guys watched Ethan's birthday party, she was talking about it on there. I caught her talking about it, so I could just stop telling y'all. Y'all like, well, she keeps saying that. Which nobody judges me. I don't hear nobody says that, but I want y'all to hear for yourself. So go back and watch the whole video about how to celebrate a party when your kids are involved in CPS. But yeah, so I called Ethan last night, well yesterday, because yesterday was officially his birthday, March 7th, but we gave him a party that Wednesday, so that would have been like, what, the, the 5th? If I'm wrong, forgive me. It would have been like the 5th. So, um, the lady, Audrey, like I said, she's a very sweet, wonderful lady, and I'm very happy that she has my son. She's his godmother, and then her friend has my two girls. So when, I was, when she finally called back last night, it was about 9. But she hasn't been calling us back for about two weeks or more. Um, and we hadn't heard from her, so I'm assuming now to the point where I'm thinking like something's must be wrong with her phone because RG wouldn't do that, or either, um, you know. But I'm figuring to myself at the same time that she should have um, sent the number, new number with Ethan if that was the case, if something was wrong with her phone or you know something like that. But um, I guess that wasn't the case, but she called me yesterday and Ethan was on the phone talking to me and then I guess Emily and Ellie wind up coming over with the foster parents they're with, which is RG, Ethan's godmother, best friends, and they were coming in. And I was talking to Emily and she was like, this is Emily, and I'm like, this is mommy. She's like, mommy, I love you. So, um, it was, it was kind of, yesterday was kind of more sad for my husband than me. Because I felt like at least we did the birthday party for him and we got a chance to still celebrate it. I got a chance to still be there and see it because I'm not drunk somewhere. I'm um, making up an excuse next week why I couldn't show up because I, you know what I mean? So I felt really blessed and really grateful and really happy and joyful and, and just so excited. Even when the visit was over, I sat in the truck waiting for dad to come out because he does his business from four to six and mine's from two to four. But on the birthday, we just all clashed. When I saw him come out and I saw him carry the kids to the lady car, I walked across the street. I parked across the street at the gas station and I watched him take the kids out. And um, I didn't feel sad this time. I just felt really grateful that I was able to be there and able to do that. You know what I'm saying? And watching the kids' smiles and their faces and happy and knowing that I'm going to be there, knowing it's about to be late every Wednesday, something's happening. Well, I can't talk to you about makeup, y'all. But, um, y'all 
want to see my outfit I'm wearing? Shit in my yard. It is. It's hot in here. 
I'm not going to be doing this so much longer. Oh, no. I'm going to go pull my clothes on. Y'all want to go with me? Y'all get to see nothing. Look, this is going to be it for now. And I got to do my cheeks. And I have to do my, um, I have to do my cheeks and brush my hair. Look what I did to my room, y'all. I put this little thing up right here. Oh, that picture. And I put this up. Cute. I still got that crazy stuff on my um. I be oh my face is gonna dry. I be watching um paternity court going to sleep that I be having dreams. My husband have babies though. <laughs> Let me put my stuff on. I can still talk to y'all. I'll put y'all in my little closet thing here. I don't know what this is. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet. But I can still talk to y'all. Make sure y'all can't see me. I'm about to put, let me make sure. Yeah, I'm too far, but really. Yeah, so, um, today I just plan to really just go to church and go to Aldi's and come back home. It looks like it's gonna be nice outside. Y'all hear me? Y'all hear me struggling with my step butt, trying to get my step butt over here? Honey! You know what I asked me? He probably sit right on the couch. <laughs> wow. He probably said right there, like, I ain't about to ask her, but she gonna make me go rush to go to church. Mm -mm, that's too hot up here to my makeup. Ooh, now I can fix it. Ooh. Let me see. I should have brought my stand. All right, I can fix it and talk to y'all now. Let me see. Don't worry, I have to fix this. Don't worry about me going to church, I guess. I got everywhere to put y'all. Okay. This is a large um, I had that a medium. I could fit a medium. See, it's supposed to have little pockets right here. To Mr. passing. A prenatal DNA test was performed. A blood sample was drawn from the mother, and fetal DNA was isolated from the sample. Genetic analysis. I don't want to wear this. I'm going to wear a blazer. I don't want to turn my butt out in church. But this will be better to wear. In the case of Washer versus Smith. Let's see. When it comes to Pretty awesome. Two-year-old. See, it calms it down a lot. It makes it look cuter. And it calms it down a whole lot. It has so, been determined by this report. Everybody has tattoos in the world, so I have nothing I can do about that. Mr. Hopkins. But there is something I can do about none of that, Sean. So whoever has something to say. <laughs> Hi. Okay, yeah. I think this is cute. And the green hills. Yeah, this is nice. It's comfy, it's cozy. You so this is one of five that I got. I got a red one, I got a blue one. I have a red one, I got a blue one. Yeah, but I'm about to take this off because... You didn't have to say that. I think I had to find some tape for my... Mr. Hopkins. I have to go put on one of those what you call it bras. I just want to show you guys real quick. I'm going to dress myself some more. But um, yeah, so I'm going to brush my hair. Is the five. I probably won't even put on that necklace only That's because so I right. feel like I'm rushing. So I'll probably just do this. But then it's church, so I should just put the necklace on. Like, I'm gonna just have to slow down a little bit. I'm hot. So, yeah. What do you guys think about that? I'm going to wear the long black sweater with it, the necklace. I'm going to probably put on some smaller earrings and go do my cheeks and my lips, and I'm all ready for church. It's high. It's 62 degrees outside. But I did go buy some church dresses, but they're um, sweater dresses. But I didn't um, wash them because I went to the thrift store and found me some church dresses, and they're very cute. Aaron, go get your socks on. Look what he be doing to eat this room. Go okay. get some socks on. Get your shoes on. Oh, I'm hot, y'all. I don't like doing my makeup up here because it's too hot. And you doing makeup and it's hot, it doesn't work. But anyway, guys, I just I thought I'll come on and ramble with y'all. I don't think I can actually <laughs> be on here talking and do what I need to do as far as getting ready. Because 
I guess I can't multitask. I'm gonna let that go. So what are you guys doing today? Are y'all gonna go to church? Are y'all gonna have fun with Jesus? Are you guys gonna go out to dinner or lunch or anything or brunch with your family? What are you guys doing today? Erin, can you bring my purse? Can you bring my purse? I'm gonna start bringing all my stuff up here so I can do this stuff upstairs. And it'll be easier to talk to y'all. Plus I like my bathroom better. It's brighter. Don't worry, y'all in this mirror thing so y'all see this. But I have a stand, and I just gotta find a place to put the stand, and I can do my makeup more often. Not too much, because you'll get sick and tired of seeing that. I mean, this lighting's not that good down here, neither. I mean, up here. Look at the hat Eric got yesterday. Put it there, baby. Put it there. Look at his hat. I was on sale for ten ninety nine at Champions. I'm so broke, though, but I didn't. He needed something. My lips looking dry. Still like I be drinking. Oh, y'all, when I was drinking, not bumpy. My face still bumpy, but my eyes were so dark and so black. It was so scary. Now that I still thought I was cute, people be drinking and still think they're cute. And they be looking a hot mess. <laughs> I used to be so drunk. I had one lash hanging off. I don't want to be too. This smells good. Y'all have this one? It's called the beach. It smells really good. Brush my teeth, yay. I usually I usually put on my um I don't do all the other lip wear and stuff or nothing. <laughs> I'm old fashioned for makeup. I gotta really get in a mood to do it. But I do my makeup regular and it still looks the same as when people baking and putting all that stuff on their face. I just don't believe in putting all that crap on my face because it's just entirely too much. My husband told me that he don't even really want me to put the um Primer. You don't even want me to put the primer on because it makes me look orange, and I'm not really too sure how to do that. But I know it works for my bags under my eyes and um, stuff like that. So I be trying to do it. I'm supposed to flat iron his hair, but I'm not gonna flat iron it. I'm just gonna brush it out and put back on my black sweater. And I'm not sure if I want to wear those heels or not, but I probably will. I'm gonna walk over to church because it's so close. So. This is me getting ready for church Sunday morning in Cleveland, Ohio. It's 62 degrees. That's why my wardrobe is changing. I have to find my modest look with the clothes I'll be trying to wear, but I'll get it, y'all. So don't judge my outfit for church because, like I said, I'm going to put that black long sweater on and it has holes in it, so it's not too cold. I mean, it's not too hot. I didn't put the lotion on my body. I better stop for lotion though because it's hot now. <laughs> I feel like I'm spraying more that crap on me. It's too hot for that. I'm getting my shoes down here. My toes ain't done. I'm gonna put some lotion on my feet. Put some lotion on my feet. <laughs> and then, ow, what's going on? Mom, tell them to go to the store for Aaron wants to do a story on my channel about when he had to punch a guy named Cody in the face. Don't promote violence. Tell me you got into something and then you want to know. Aaron, can you come show them my outfit now? Because I can't. I don't have my stand up here. Y'all don't judge my ashy feet. I'm about to go sit on the couch downstairs and finish that off. Just want to give y'all a little bit of a...
the brown one would have been cute now that I think about it. This is getting nice outside, so I don't want to eat the brown one. I look nice. Mm -hmm. I don't feel put together yet, you know, probably because I stuff in my face. I can make my face feel still weird. Right, so here we go. Let me know. But yep, this is it. Oh god, stairs. What have I gotta do downstairs? But I do have um my bed's junky. My bed's low. <laughs> oh, oh my bed's low. Oh, hey. I'll hold the phone near in. Um, yeah. No, a little closer. I have this blue one. Got a blue one. I have I'm gonna try them all later for y'all. Step back some more, please. This one, let me stand up. My lazy butt. And I have this one. Step back over here, son. I have this one to wear. I have this one. This one's cute. And then I have, I have an all red one, but I don't think I have this one to wear. These are, like I said, they were $12.99. Oh, yeah, I have bought me some all black leggings. <laughs> so it's all wrong with like sweater dresses. Then I have bought me some little jeans. I have a black one too. Did I show y'all? This one's in a medium. This one's in the medium because I tried this. I'm going to wear with my husband and try to dress it up and be kind of cute, cute. I'm not going to wear that one anywhere like that, but this blue one's cute too. And to put it down here, they all go to the ankle. So, with the little ruffles. Okay. So, guys, that's it for me. Quick, get ready with me for church. I'm going to probably go put on a gold. I'm probably going to put on a gold necklace. Look at me and my robe on the floor. I'm still trying for I gotta get organized with this stuff because I can't. I'm gonna have to bring my stand up here and do this because getting dressed up here feels better, but the bathroom's just super hot. All right, y'all. Bye. I'm gonna go put on my necklace. Put some lotion on. Look at my purse. <laughs> so chunky. But yeah, this is my little bathroom. I broke this when I was drunk one day. Idiot. I'm really morale. Up over there. I have that love sign up here. I have this back here. But, oh, and I have this right here. I'm gonna start putting my camera thing here. So my bathroom's kinda cute. It's coming along. Here's my finish left. I guess I don't look too bad. Yeah, we gotta get going. Let me grab my foot. I'm not gonna I gotta see how long I got. Oh. My husband's probably gonna be on time. I don't know what time it is. I had to come down the stairs really good. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna blow my candles out down here. Oh, I can show y'all my little pieces since I'm down here right now. Uh, so I have. I got um. Y'all still see me? It doesn't want to come loose. <laughs> I don't know how much a home project costs. I don't know much, but I know I love you. And that may be all there is to know. I'll be singing this song stuck here in my hand. <coughs> and I want to come with y'all. I might have to show y'all later. But I'm going to show y'all my little bathroom. Okay, y'all. So I'm going to show y'all my little bathroom. 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 But this is a small one. It's thin. But it's so bad because I want to show y'all and not let y'all see. I want to actually put it on. Here, hold this on, Erin. Thank you, sweet love. Look, and then I'm going to be like, Erin, why aren't you ready? Like, Mom, you keep telling me to hold the freak phone. And I'm going to be yelling at you. Look, I bet you rinsed out her shaving. Why is this not working, Erin? She said, you hold it, I'll do it. No, I don't want you to break it. You go break it. Don't break that. No, VVS challenge. VVS? Yeah. Wait. Oh, don't this is from the dang old rainbows. Y'all know what rainbows is? <laughs> Do y'all know what rainbows is? Yeah. Well, we want to wear this one. Because it's so pretty. It'll really add a classy look to it. I wonder if I just undo this. Hey. Hey, got it. Hey. 
I got it, y'all. I got it, y'all. That seems too little. No, I don't wait for that. What the heck? No, what you How does it? You know, also put it in there. The Shut up, Aaron. <laughs> How do I do this? It doesn't make sense. So this will be. I ain't flutter on my hair. I'm about to look so disgusting. I, I, I gotta get off this thing because I have to put something on my feet. Okay, so it's like that. Then I feel like I'm choking. What the? I feel like I'm choking. <laughs> I need Jesus bad. Like I'm about to fan myself with my daily bread. All right, guys. Thank you so much for getting ready with me. It was kind of hectic, but this is what I go through. I like this outfit. It's so comfortable. I hope I don't. Y'all tell me down below. Do I look too much for church, or do I just look like nice? My sister be on here. She'll tell me. She is like, girl, lose the scarf. I love you, Becky Boo. I love you, Onion. She doesn't smell like Onion or anything. It's just the way she says Onion. She says Onion, and she's. Oh, it's so cute. She still says it the same way she did when she was little. So I'm like, onion. Or I'm like, say onion. And she'll say it too because she's so late. But yeah, shoes. Oh, lotion. Erin, what time is it? All right, guys, I got to go. I think I did pretty good for this video. Next time when I try to close her, I'm going to set up the camera. And yeah, I don't have to be all over the place. So I'm going to church. And um, bye, guys. I'll hate my makeup. It doesn't look too pretty, but bye.